The extinction of the dinosaurs, which occurred approximately 66 million years ago, is one of the most significant mass extinction events in Earth's history. It marked the end of the Mesozoic era, specifically at the Cretaceous-Paleogene (KPG) boundary, formerly known as the KT boundary. This event wiped out about 75% of all species on Earth, including all non-avian dinosaurs, and led to the rise of mammals as the dominant land animals. The primary cause of this extinction is widely believed to be the result of a combination of catastrophic events. Asteroid Impact – Main Cause the leading hypothesis is that a massive asteroid, around 10 to 15 kilometers or 6 to 9 miles wide, struck the Earth in what is now the Yucatan Peninsula, Mexico, forming the Chicxulub Crater. This impact occurred about 66 million years ago and is supported by strong geological and chemical evidence. Evidence for impact. Around the world, a thin layer of sediment rich in iridium, a rare element on Earth but common in asteroids, has been found in rocks dating to the KPG boundary. This layer is considered strong evidence of a large extraterrestrial object striking Earth. Minerals such as shocked quartz, a form of quartz that has been deformed by high pressure, and tektites, glass formed by intense heat during impact, have been found in this layer, indicating a massive impact. The Chicxulub crater buried beneath the Yucatan Peninsula is about 150 kilometers or 93 miles in diameter. Its age aligns with the timing of the extinction event and its size suggests it was created by an asteroid powerful enough to cause global devastation. Immediate effects. The asteroid's impact released energy equivalent to billions of nuclear bombs. This would have caused widespread fires, shockwaves and massive tsunamis. The impact would have thrown huge amounts of debris, dust and vaporized rock into the atmosphere, blocking sunlight and causing a dramatic cooling of Earth's surface a nuclear winter effect. This would have disrupted photosynthesis, leading to a collapse of food chains, especially for herbivores and the carnivores that depended on them. The heat from the impact likely ignited global wildfires, further reducing oxygen levels and making survival for large animals even more difficult. Volcanic activity Deccan traps. Around the same time as the asteroid impact, massive volcanic eruptions were occurring in present-day India, creating the Deccan traps one of the largest volcanic features on Earth. These eruptions are thought to have contributed to the environmental stress leading up to and following the asteroid impact. The Deccan Traps released vast amounts of volcanic gases, including carbon dioxide and sulfur dioxide, into the atmosphere. This could have had two major effects. Over time, increased carbon dioxide levels could have caused long-term global warming. Meanwhile, sulfur dioxide would have led to the formation of sulfuric acid in the atmosphere, causing acid rain. This acid rain would have further harmed plant life and disrupted ecosystems. The combination of the asteroid impact and prolonged volcanic activity likely created a double whammy effect on Earth's environment, amplifying the catastrophic consequences for many species, including dinosaurs. The climate change and ecological disruption the asteroid impact would have caused, well, a rapid and extreme cooling followed by a longer period of warming due to volcanic activity. Such rapid climate fluctuations would have been devastating to the delicate balance of ecosystems. Many dinosaurs, especially the large herbivores, relied on abundant plant life. The reduction of sunlight from the dust and aerosols in the atmosphere would have drastically reduced plant productivity, starving herbivores and in turn the carnivores that preyed on them. The release of CO2 from the Deccan Traps and the acid rain may have contributed to ocean acidification, severely affecting marine life, including plankton and other small organisms that form the base of the marine food chain. Selective survival, why some species survived. Modern birds are descendants of small, feathered theropod dinosaurs that survived the extinction event. Their ability to fly, smaller size and dietary flexibility likely helped them survive the catastrophic conditions. Small mammals also survived the extinction, likely because they could burrow and find shelter from the extreme conditions. Their generalist diets may have allowed them to eat a wider variety of foods, including seeds and small invertebrates. Crocodiles, turtles and some reptiles survived the extinction as well, possibly due to their semi-aquatic lifestyles and ability to go long periods without food. Aftermath of the Extinction The extinction of the non-avian dinosaurs marked the end of the Mesozoic era, in the aftermath, with dinosaurs gone, ecological niches opened up for mammals, which had previously lived in the shadow of the giant reptiles. 
Over time, mammals diversified and evolved into the dominant land animals, eventually giving rise to primates and later humans. The extinction of the dinosaurs was likely caused by a combination of catastrophic events, primarily the impact of a massive asteroid and the widespread volcanic activity of the Deccan Traps. These events triggered severe environmental changes, including drastic cooling, wildfires, acid rain, and a collapse of the food chain, which led to the extinction of most species, including the non-avian dinosaurs. However, small mammals and certain reptiles, as well as birds, survived and eventually thrived in the post-dinosaur world. <laughs>